Greetings to you from Liberty Life Wanderers. An hour and a half after the scheduled start of this first castle test match between India and South Africa. The Indian lineup today, minus Harvajan Singh, but including three seamers, Singh, Srithan and Zahir Khan with Anil Kumbli there. South Africa, no spinner in their lineup as we have known for a while. And that is the uh, lineup for South Africa. First use of the ball, Stain and Tini Nell, Pollock and Callis, the five prong pace attack. Here we go. Oh, nice start from Dale Stain on the money. Here it is, and he's got it away for the first boundary of this test match. Short ball, and Jaffa deals with it very well. That's close. That's very, very close. Up goes the finger. McClantini and Wazim Jaffa's woeful tour continues. Just nipping back a little bit off the seam. It didn't bounce as much as he anticipated. 14 for one. Here's the run. Is it a catch? Yes, he's gone. Suddenly, India, all sorts of trouble. Sean Pollock deserved that wicket. He outthought his man. Well, Sean Pollock just stays in that corridor of uncertainty. That's where he's had a lot of success against the Indian batsmen in the one-day games. That continues here. It makes it very hard from the batting point of view to know which to play and which to let go. 14 for two. The little master, the little maestro. 34 test hundreds for uh, Sachin Tendulkar. Oh, he's away by Dravid. And that is a fine way to get off the mark, having... Uh... Wow! Beautiful shot. And over the top. That's nicely played. Intentional shot. That is an intentional shot. And uh, with that, Sachin Tendulkar has scored ten and a half thousand career test runs. That, I was, I was waiting for the fielder to get across and pick it up, but it's not a chance. It's running away to the long off boundary, beautifully timed, just leaning on it. Edge gone! Beautiful piece of bowling. Callis gets the big wicket. And De Villiers takes the catch. It's 83 for three. And he'll squeeze it away between Gully and the pit slip to the boundary. Oh, the short run, he's got it away. Back with a square, four runs, two in a row. It's and gone. Beautifully bowled, Jack Collis. That really is a good delivery. We talked about bowling fuller and fighting the drive. He's worked hard for this wicket. It's up there. Just a little bit of uh, nipping off the seam there. And that's a good catch by uh, the captain, Graham Smith. And the rail driver goes for 31. It's 110 for four. Mind you, it is swinging. And uh, you know, the in swing to the left hand are always difficult to, to face. Flipped away. That's beautifully played. Done it again. That's a better shot, but uh, he's encouraging his man to play through there if we can get our man. And uh, I'm afraid he's not going to get uh, the wicket if he places it there. Four runs, beautifully timed, but not the best line or length from Nell. Nice straight now against the right hand at four runs. Has taken an outstanding catch, and Davies' steel shot has ended in his, dem his demise. <laughs> Sean Pollock, he will not take a better catch in his whole life, ever. That is brilliant. John T. Rhodes would have been extremely happy with that run. Downey must be wondering what's happened. He's got to go though. 
Oh, he's got that through. These are useful runs. Edge and into the center pass as a second slip. Jack Palace making no mistake. And finally, Andre Nell rewarded. There it goes. Didn't get all of it. He's just chipped it over mid on. Let's go! in pursuit. And a comfortable three. 202 for seven. Oh, that's got to be close. Oh, he's almost walking. <laughs> oh, that was the brain fade. He was uh, looking to smash it away. Sean Pollock outthought him. He's had quite a morning, Sean Pollock. Wonderful catch. Now he gets uh, a wicket. Tiny little contribution from Carl. No, it comes to an end. India 205 halfway. It's crafty stuff from Pollock. In the air. And uh, straight away, Sean Pollock. Twice in the over. He did catch from Hashimanda. He had to make a little bit of ground to his left, but he had no trouble doing that. Sri Sant has to go for a duck. And I'm down for India. Vikram Singh comes to the crease as number 11. And uh, at the other end, on 39, is Sarav Ganguly. That's how he'll play. And I'll tell you what, if he has a bit of luck, he could still get to 250. There. Oh, dear idea. <laughs> Take that, Jack Gullis. Did the right thing pitching it up. Smacked away again. Baseball style. This is 2020. Oh, it was up there, and he's been carved away to long off, looking for that slow ball into the... And another one, this time over the leg side, and that is Formal. He's moving all over the crease as Pollock bowls. And that's Ganguly's 50. It will be a very, very good first innings here. And in the air, and Pollock surely must get his fourth wicket. And the end of the innings, 249 all out, India. Ending an exhilarating last wicket stand. Sing out for 29. Yeah, Pollock, Sean Pollock there, four, four times on there. And a good contribution from Antini, who... Uh, a little bit out of sorts, uh, hasn't been himself by uh, all accounts. But uh, 2.49, India managed to, to get. Welcome back to the Wanderers, and the Indian team has uh, made its way out to the centre. And he'll start the proceedings to Smith. Three slips in place. And straight away goes past the outside edge. Asking the questions. First runs for Smith. That'll make him feel better. A couple of runs comfortably taken. Now that's close. That is close. In fact, Smith was even walking just as the finger was coming up. So Shrishan strikes early. Slowed down the pace. There it is, pitching just about on off stump. And coming back, Graham Smith shuffling across, try, trying to do the little dance to get the leg out of the way. Bang, into the stumps. The skipper goes again. A little bit of a technical problem. The Indians have exploited it. Sri Sant has got the breakthrough. Ashim Amla comes out to the middle. That's in the air, take him. And the Indians cock a hoop here. Two wickets inside five minutes. Succumbed to a bit of pressure. Zahir Khan has had a very, very good tour. Again, a loose shot from Gibbs. Nicely taken by Saywag, I think it is. He's happy. Gibbs, very loose. Pressure, I think, got to him. He's gone for a zero. Oh, good delivery first up. Right in the block hole. It's the and taken 
It's carried to VVS Lakshman. The Indians are all over the shop in the field. They've taken three wickets in the space of just 10 minutes. This is Amla. Just a matter of time. It was only a matter of time before he got a nick. A nice neat catch by Laxman, but uh, temperament maybe in question, maybe not. Technique certainly in question, and he's paid the penalty as Hashim Amla. He's gone for a zero. Yeah, it's a combination of poor shot selection, poor technique, and pressure. That's what it's done. Yeah! On the pads. That is close. That is close. He took a good hard look, Daryl Harper. Now that's adding insult to injury. Pitch stop. Beautifully struck down the ground. Daryl Harper. Apologies to Daryl Harper and uh, apologies to Jacques Collis. And he's going to make him pay it. Nicely played on the onside. That will reach the boundary. Edge and taken. The breakthrough so quickly after lunch. Three thirds on fire. He's got three. Callis, the big fish, goes. And South Africa, 21 for four. And this is a fine catch off the outside edge. Third slip coming in front of him. Laxman catching that low down. And that is a very good piece of cricket by the Indians. 21 for four. The new batsman for South Africa is A.B. de Villiers. And uh, he comes in with South Africa well and truly in the cart here. 21 for, five, for four. Wow, take that. Cracking stroke. Oh, it's in the air and out. A spiteful delivery. Khan gets the wicket. De Villiers goes. South Africa, 33 for five. Bounce steeply. Just couldn't get over the top of it. It looked like he tried to play it on the onside. Leading edge, Sawak taking his second catch of the innings. And South Africa now really in dire straits. 33 for 5. Thoroughly against the wall now. Archer has pulled them out of trouble on a number of occasions. And that might be uh, boundary number 5. Two of those came from Kellis in one over. A good friend Mark catches. Bowling off the inside edge. Mark Batcher playing away from his body. Well, here's the answer from uh, Sri Sand. I think that wicket has given him the most delight of all. Sean Pollock. Well, I bet when he took that brilliant catch to uh, dismiss Dhoni, he thought he'd have his feet up for the rest of the day. Question that. Just like that. A good timer of the ball. It's a trait in the Pollock family. He's uh, away. Now oh, going down. Oh, he's given. Oh, my initial reaction was it's going down. But uh, he was quite a long way back in the crease, and the umpire thought that's good enough for me. Pollock on his way. Gee, where's three sand? That's his best ever in Test cricket. Well, let's have him batting lineup. After this performance, we'll have a lot more respect for him. Neil Benson, uh, Mark Benson, excuse me, was quick with the decision. Walker agrees with him. And it's gone from bad to worse now. South Africa seven down with only 45 on the board. The dangerous Pollock goes for five. Again put away. This time uh, a lot better from Ashley Prince. That's off the middle. And now something that Andre Nell will do is throw the ball at you. He sticks his tongue out. <laughs> Take that, son. He's watching himself here. <laughs> no.
That's a solid blow. Big gap in the ground there between Middolf and Middolf. That's four. Oh! Now he goes up, and this time the finger goes up. You can rely on Anil Kumble to do the job for you. Because they believe if uh, Mantini attacks, it will be on the onside. Oh! To him! Off stump rattled. Two wickets and two balls for Anil Kumble. This is brilliant bowling by Anil Kumble. That's a much quicker delivery. It's at least 10 k's quicker and it surprised Makai and Tini. It's thoughtful bowling. He's just got Prince one that went on with the arm. And now he's got Antini where he's just absolutely fizzed it past him. That's in the air. Zahir Khan running back. He's got a safe pair of hands. Takes it easily. South Africa bundled out for 84. And they deserved it. That equals the lowest score by South Africa. And they were bowled out in just 130 minutes. 26th over this is. And Andre now succumbs. Good catch by Khan. Coming over the shoulder is not easy when you're running back. Judged it to perfection. And what a performance by India. A little bit of swing. And the South African techniques were found wanting. First sub-100 total since readmission for South Africa. 84 all out here at Liberty Life Wanderers. Ten years since they got bowled out for just over 100 by India. It should be a very entertaining first hour size cricket. Here we go. be look to be playing the ball oh it's gone down to the third man boundary for four slash and that'll go past the dive from prince to the beat deep backward point boundary edge and gone smith takes the catch now gets the breakthrough and india lose their first wicket and jaffa goes he goes for four India 24-1. He's glanced it away and races down to the boundary for four. Offline. Edge and through the gap. Another boundary in the over. Out. That's it. Very good wicket. Sean Pollock straight away. Why did they take so long to bring him on? He's a master. He's a master. 400 test wickets for Sean Pollock. 37 for two, India. Just coming to the crease, Sachin Tendulkar. Again, that's uh, this time. This time, it was only a matter of time. Say, Wag, because that's kind of play. He's got it 33. That's about par for the course over here in South Africa, the way he plays. You've got to get an edge eventually. And the catching has been pretty good from South Africa. Say, so Wag goes to 33. It's 41 for three. BBS Laxman makes his way to the crease. the mark the big stride we talked about <laughs> lovely shot didn't try and hit it too hard but the footwork was assured and positive what's so good to see is the stride in this innings that's four more these are all valuable runs when you consider the lead India has That didn't bounce as much as Tendulkar expected. Sean Pollock produces one that didn't get up, but it has to be said that Tendulkar played a long way away from his body there. His footwork just let him down, dragged it onto the stumps. Disappointment for him. Big wicket for South Africa, 61 for four. Nice cut away, handsomely. And that could go to the boundary as well. Andre now giving chase. Wow, isn't he giving it everything? I think that's gone to the boundary. And there we go again. And that, although Prince is giving Skelter chase, it's gone to the boundary. That's in the air and wide of slip. And to make matters worse, in uh, nearly two years. Oh, beautifully played. Just picked off that line and sent away down to wide long on.
for four. And that's up in the air. Where's that? This guy has dragged it on. I thought it had gone. Oh, gee whiz. I think it's uh, caught behind, just about carrying to Boucher. I it's thought it had hit the stumps. That's what I thought. It's just the bottom edge. And Mark Boucher, leaning forward, takes a good catch. So Ganguly has just committed suicide, in my opinion. But he's done it again. He's played that shot, got himself out. 119 for five. Mahindra Singh Dhoni comes to the crease. Well, that went like a bullet. It, it ain't over yet. Could be more. Oh, he smashes that. One bounce, two, three, over the rope. Edge gone. Beautiful delivery. Perfect length, and he's been a master at that. He's been the outstanding bowler for South Africa, and again, he emphasizes that with a lovely delivery and reward. Tony, 147 for six. And he's caught. That backward point of Gully, if you like, by Ashwell Prince. Slicing it away. Nell gets the second record of the morning. India, 148 for seven. Flick that away in the air, and good timing. In the air, but through the gap. There's the slog. Has he got enough bat on it? Yes, I think he has. Big shot, and that is going right up into the sense. Huge blow from Flaxman. It's a short outside off stump and Smith shouts in anguish as he's carved away to the backward point boundary for four. Ten off the over. That's Big, oh. oh, he's hit it straight back so hard. Smith couldn't hold it. It's gone to the boundary for four. That's Big hit. You can catch it in the stands. It's going to bring the end of uh, Smith's short little spell, surely. Not too pretty either. Edged, caught, is it? Grabbing it. There's a glance at the umpire. But uh, Makai Rantini comes up with the goods. 218 for eight, a lead of 383. Yeah, there's another one. There's another one. He gets inspired when he gets a wicket, does Makai Rantini. That was a lot quicker. 2-1-9 for 9. And smashed it away. How far is it gone? <laughs> oh, it's on for young and old, yeah. <laughs> He's almost wound his arm up. What's this then, the glance? <laughs> so you're gonna love it. He's a fasty little character. Smashed over the top, and this will be four. The Taylor's enjoying themselves. Followed him this time, but he still swung it away on the leg side. Oh, the out there. oh, he'll have to hurry. This is a good chance of a run out, and it's going to be called. I think he's gone. I think he's gone. The throw came in from Demisa Makalima. Bausch had a lot of work to do here. He gathered it cleanly on the half volley coming back in at the stumps taking the balls off and he's out and you know that you're under pressure to get it to the stumps he did it beautifully it really was there it is the cheer goes up south africa need 402 402 is the target zahir khan who's had a very very good tour has got the new ball in his hands yeah! that's got to be close and it's got to be close both ways LBW and it might have hit the glove on the way up. Huge dive. Nick. Yeah. A pair for Russell Gibbs and Zahir Khan, as he has done throughout this tour, has struck again, head down for Herschel Gibbs. And trouble for South Africa right at the start. 
Oh, well played. Shot and four. And that's beautiful use of the pace of the ball and the direction. Oh, he's gone. Caught it back by point. Wide delivery, playing away from the body. He just couldn't resist it. Poor shot selection. He couldn't resist it, quite rightly so. What a catch that is. That's a brilliant catch. And the aeroplane takes off. It's going to be a no ball, and it's going to go for four off the pads. Wide of the crease and just wide. Beautifully done. Oh, that is excellent bowling. Oops, you don't do that, young man. You've done enough by getting him out really close to the stumps. Beautifully bowled, though, really close to the stumps. Got his man. Excellent. Yet again, the length being so good. Hamlin not quite behind it. Ashwell Prince comes to the crease. Oh. Lovely shot. No need to run for that. He just picked it away on the onside. Oh, great shot. Great shot. Lovely to watch, Callis. It's been taken. What a wicket here for India. Full marks to Sri Sant. He threw the bait at Callis. You've got to give credit here. This is a very good bowling. Superb bowling. You don't often nick Callis off like this. It was there to be driven, but it was the lightness of the swing. He's had such a good position with the ball, the release out the end. 84 for 4, A.B. de Villiers comes out to the middle. South Africa in deep trouble now, they've lost Callis. Oh, it's gone through. Suwag and down to the boundary for 4. Time's difficult to stop those. Smashed away. No trouble at all. Bounce going out of the track and it's just set up nicely. Maybe he doesn't miss those. Oh, this is going to be quick. That's got to be very quick. There's going to be a call for the uh, replay. Eyes well out. Well, I guess it's just the innocence of youth, but on the stump, Mike. Could hear all the time now they've been talking uh, i'm quicker than you it was brilliant feeling there by zaya khan yeah, he's paid a penalty he's so confident in his own running he thinks he can run to everybody and that says that you cannot oh that's slapped away through the onside a short delivery got into position quickly Boucher. That's close. He's gone. Beautiful delivery from Zahir Khan. Good shape. And Boucher caught in front of his stumps. And India get the breakthrough. Didn't add to his 23. 164 for six. Tailing in. <laughs> it was almost there. But he gets some bad on it. And he'll find the boundary as well. Nicely timed. There's the flick of the wrist, and the ball will reach the boundary. Then he'll have four there. Oh! Bowled in. Well called, Alan Donald. Sean Pollock just going for one shot too many. And you wonder why. He hits the ball so beautifully straight. Why does he have to go across the line? He's done an A-B. And it's cost him his wicket, and Anil Kumble has done the job just before the new ball. Congratulations all round from the Indians. They, they know how important that is. That'll be four. Nicely played by Andre now. That's uh, beautifully bowled. He set him up so well there, Anil Kumble. A couple of flighted deliveries, then the quicker one. South Africa 2.45 and 4.8. Oh, that's a lovely shot. It didn't bounce as much as he expected, but he adjusted so well. Will he take on Kumle? Oh! He's played all over it. 
They cannot believe it. Disappointment all round because he played really well and deserved a hundred. Unfortunately, he has to depart for 97. Well, just one more wicket needed for India. And Tini lasted just one ball in the first innings and he was cleaned up by Kumble. It's in the air. Virinda Sirak takes the catch that makes history for India. Their first win in Test cricket in South Africa. Absolute delight and richly deserved for India throughout this Test match. They've dominated it and this is how it's ended. Wonderful performance by India. They came into this Test match very determined to reverse the results of the one-day series. They did so. They were focused. They were well prepared. They took South Africa on under South Africa's conditions that suits them generally at the Wanderers, a pitch that suited the faster bowlers. Raul Dravid, quite rightly, delighted. And the series now is well and truly alive. So that's how it all transpired here. India 249, South Africa skittle for 84. India forging a lead of 402, South Africa 278 all out. India win by 123.